We are live at Skinnin B. Johnson Stadium in International Speedway in Barron Bristlejock, Georgia. The Ork Dork cheering section is already in the spirit of things I can see. They've already dismembered the opposing team's mascot. <laughs> Nicely done, great fans. Did you know that being an NFL mascot is the leading cause of death for overqualified college graduates? Both teams hit the field ready to hit each other in this NFL matchup. Tokyo Terminators take on the Orcs of Hazard. Welcome to MFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. If you're just waking up wondering who put that vice on your head and filled your mouth with vacuum cleaner, dirt, and cattle litter, you're not alone. After all, it's Sunday, MFL game day. Hey, you look tired, Junior. And Bricks, you look like they just used your head in field goal practice. Spent all night in the ER. We ate Chinese food last night. Food poisoning? I wish. I got the chopsticks lost in my ears again. You know, they should have a warning on that bitch. And it's first and ten. And he held on to that one for a first down. And it's first and ten. Second down in a very long. Oh, great pass on that play. They caught the defense napping. And that'll bring up third and one. position in football the mighty punter and the punter has one job to do and that's punt the ball no return on this punt the defense will just down it i can't tell if he's smart or scared either way the ball is down and it's first and ten Almost broke that one wide open. Hey, speaking of breaking one wide open, who's sitting on the oil rig about to blow? Hey, smells like an oven big porta Johnny. We're breaking fracking accident waiting to happen. Don't nobody light a match. And that'll bring up second and one. They go to the ground game and pick up the first. Nicely done. And it's first and ten. And that's how you run it, folks. Picks up eight there. Second down and two. He's not going down. Man, oh man, he hit that line the way your wife hits the all-you-can-eat buffet of crab apple tree bricks. Ah, uh, you're telling me. She ate 47 Salisbury steaks one time. Thought she had food poisoning. Turns out her low intestines just exploded. No, that's a relief, because there's nothing worse than food poisoning. Ah, uh, you're telling me. That's the way to move the chains. That's good for a first down. This game is all about momentum and killing. And it's first and ten. And that's the 
the way to get the sticks moving. He picks up five yards on that play. Second down and five. Third down and nine. And this guy is supercharged with electricity. Fumble. You've got to protect the ball better than that. Skid marks. Second down in a lot. And like a monkey trying to fuck a grease football, he gets away in a hurry. It's a touchdown! Extra point, but you never know with kickers. <laughs> the kick is good. Yeah, as expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. They need a good return here to set up the offense. Looks like he'll be able to run this one back if he's not terrified for his life. He is, but he's got no choice. First and ten. Oh, ho, ho. that gets me every time. Like a jack in a box, Bricks. You never know when one of those hot potatoes is going to blow. You just crap your pants, Junior. And it's first and ten. for nine on that play. And that'll bring up second and one. The defense didn't give an inch. No gain on that play. And that'll bring up third and one. What? I mean, first down! What the hell was that? I, uh, I honestly don't know, Grim. It's anyone's game at the end of quarter one. And it's first and ten. A nice run there for eight yards. Second down and two. If there were any functioning brain cells before that hit, they're gone now. He's going to have the IQ of a rutabaga after that hit. And it's first and ten. And that's a sack. The quarterback has to get rid of the ball there. Second down and long. It's two-yard run before he stopped. Third down and the punter is warming up. The offense is pretty much on 
unstoppable when they use their beast boost injection. Close your eyes, Bricks. This is going to get ugly fast. And he runs it in for the touchdown. Don't try to get fancy here. Just put the ball down and kick it. In that order, Grim? It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuffed burrito from Taco Hell. Here comes the kicker. Oh, I can't wait to hear this. What's the kicker, Grim? Uh, this guy in the field. Oh, I thought you were going to tell me a story like, here's the kicker. When I turned on the light, it wasn't a brawn in my bed. It was a chick wearing a wig. That, my friends, was an all-pro NFL hit. And it's first and ten. And the defense jumps outside. And the QB has to try to run out of bounds before they get to him. Needless to say, with seven crazed defenders coming after him, that's not easy. Ah, the old quarterback shellac play. First and ten. Pow! With the brain scrambler! Second down in a very lot. And he fumbles it, Bricks. That was a screwed up play if I ever saw one. With a brutal hit. And it's first and ten. And he picks up maybe four on that play. Second down and six. And he picks up about six on the play. Third down and a pussy here. First down! He hit that line the way a rolled up dollar bill sticking out of flimsy Lohan's nose. It's a mare in Lost Wages, Nevada. And it's first and ten. Second down and more than the QB would like. He had it for a second there. Third down and, well, good luck. If you don't think you can make the interception, batting it down is the next best thing. Great advice, Grim. That receiver's gonna go far in this league if he listens to you. I wasn't talking to... Yeah, never mind. Yes, Brick, he will. That's the way to keep the chains moving. That was beautiful. First down and five. We're at the two-minute warning, and we'll take a quick timeout. Graham, will you tell the interns to get us some Frank and dogs and a couple of beers and dry over here? I'll take nachos and a scotch. Uh, we should take a pee for me, too. And they 
They stopped the clock with their first time out to try and stay in this game. Ah, oh, nice coaching move here. Hall of Fame caliber. Well, I mean, it's a pretty standard coaching move at this point of the game. I won't listen to this blasphemy. And he zips that one in there for a touchdown. Yeah, I'd like to say take the camera off him so he can just continue this game, but that's how we lost our last seven camera guys. Orcs really love their spotlight. <laughs> Well, a little chip shot here, extra point, but this guy could blow it. The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if the defense can hold them. And that's a returnable ball. Returnable? You mean he can get a refund for it? No, no, Bricks. It means he can return it for... You know what? Never mind. First and ten. Oh, and he just turns ginormous. Look out! Second down, and ain't gonna happen, partner. says who's next the 30 he's at the 20 the 10 he scores he earned those points on the heels of an epic run nah, don't call things epic grim kids aren't gonna think you're cool no matter what you do junior i don't want kids to think i'm cool Okay, nice and easy like a two-foot putt. You miss two-foot putts all the time, Grim. It's good. team is feeling confident as they get the kickoff into the air. Scoring makes anyone confident. It certainly does, Bricks. It certainly does. High five! <laughs> and that's the end of the second quarter. Someone will need to pull together some bribe money as they head to their lockers. Stay with us for the halftime show, brought to you by our friends at Monsatan Industries. We make genetically altered Franken food you'll have fun trying to identify. The teams line up for the kickoff to start the second half. These guys will have to play a lot harder to make it a game. Well, either that or kill and cheat more. <laughs> They're looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck or if that was just a one-time thing. Second down and five.
He's supercharged and can electrocute. Oh, and the defender knocked the ball out when he was in midair. It is a fumble indeed. Fumble Bachi, the new game from Wilton Crabtree. And it's first and ten. It's a jailbreak, and the defense jumps offside to kill the ref. Ho oh, ho! Crowd's loving it. And it's first and ten. Up five on that play. Second down and five. You ever get hit in the head with a boat all grim? Nope. Well, I have on several occasions. Not surprising. Multiple times on each occasion. Not surprising. And trust me, that hit was worse. First in and three. <laughs> and that was a bone crusher right there, folks. Second down and seven. And he rumbles into the end zone for the score. I hope he's not going to dance now. Now, there are some who would argue that we should just skip this step and make touchdowns worth seven. What, and kick the kicker's job in half? They'd just be called sinners. Straight through the uprights. <laughs> the best kind of kick is when it's right after a score. Hey, speak for yourself. I'm usually the one who gets kicked after scoring. First and ten. Tired of the quarterback's tight spirals and magnetic personality. But if he was still talking, he'd probably be saying, Psycho killer. Qu'est-ce que c'est? What the fuck the fuck the fuck? <laughs> the offense lost another quarterback on the previous play and have only two left before they have to forfeit. Yeah, but on the bright side, Wim, they save a ton of money by not having to pay those guys anymore. I don't think the funeral expenses that is. And it's first and ten. You want to do some fun on your time? Second down in a lot. They just made up a whole lot of field in a hurry with that pass play. And I just made up a new name for a sandwich. Third down and eight. And Chainsaw's really the rest
And here comes the extra point attempt. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuffed burrito from Taco Hell. When you get knocked down, you gotta get right back up and fight. Uh, what about when you get knocked up? What do you do then? Run. And it's first and ten. He took a beast boost injection. Now watch him stomp all over his opponents. I want to take a beast boost injection too. Uh, now that has weird side effects, Bricks. Ouch! What is this, 80s wrestling? And it's first and ten. Killer, it was right there, and then he dropped it. Ah, oh, scumbag is killing me in the fantasy league. Second down and ten. And they stack the line, and he gets his bell rung for a yard. Third down and nine. Talking about Butterfingers, he should have had that one. Thank God he's still got his leg. He's going to need all of it for this kick. And it's good! You know, when in this league where murder and bribery are cheered, it's good to be good, huh? I mean, can't we all just... Not this shit again. Bricks, I'm stopping it right there. He sets up for the return. Let's see if he can break one wide open. And it's first and ten. <laughs> Nicely done for a first down. First and ten. And the quarterback finds his man for the first down. First and four. Oh, mama. He just knocked him into the next time zone. Once he finds his head, he'll be okay. Second down and more than the QB would like. The defender says, I don't think so. Third down and the punter is warming up. The drive was stalled, and here comes the field goal attempt. And the defense just called the ginormous dirty trick. It, it goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuffed burrito from Taco Hell. When you give up points, you need to get them back. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if they can make them pay. away from oh what the brutal hit and that brings us to the end of the third quarter they'll need to fire on all cylinders to make a comeback in the final quarter
And it's first and ten. He dropped it. If he does that again, they'll drop him. Second down and ten. Remember, folks, in the NFL, you are allowed to touch the quarterback just like that. Third down and forever. removed without Novocaine. If I had all my teeth knocked out like that, I'd have them made at the dice, Grim. It'd be fun to gamble with my own teeth. <laughs> and he put all of his foot into that one. He's got the ball now and is going to try and score. That, my friends, was an all-pro NFL hit. And it's first and ten. Second down in a very long. And he snatches that one out of the air for a first down. See if they can get the offense down to their last quarterback. If they lose him, they lose the game. And it's first and ten. And it's first and ten. Second down and long. And they line up for the extra point. The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. The home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. and fumbles the ball. And no one's going to his shiv after the game. The 10! This defender is not going to be stopped. Once he picked up that loose ball, he was going to... And the kicker just bit the dust on that play. Someone will have to call up the bench to replace him. The burn returner was maimed by the opposing team, so it's up to the next man to replace him. Yeah, what exactly is a burn returner, Grim? You know, players who catch kickoffs and punts and run them back through the teeth of the defense. They have the lowest survivability rate of any player in the league. The next man up just sat back down on the bench. He probably cramped his pants. Don't want to make any mistakes here. Just kick the ball through the upright, for God's sake. Straight through the uprights. They're looking.
looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck or if that was just a one-time thing. First and ten. One potato, two potato, three potato, four. The defense just blew up a player who thought he was going to score. <laughs> oh, that hot potato dirty trick gets him every time. And it's first and ten. Give them four more downs to punish the defense. And you better believe they will. And it's first and ten. And the defense just looks clueless out here right now. And it's first and ten. Pickup of about three on that play. Second down and seven. And then Cats will give them a first down. I don't know if they're his, but he sure has a good set of hands. First and eight to go. Two minutes remaining in the game. We'll be right back, folks. Jeez, can this game take any longer? I got a date with Hot Wanda after this. Junior, I told you that girl's nothing but trouble. And I don't think that's a mole on her lip either. That's about a three-yard pickup. Second down and five. Third down and long. Either the defense is trying to keep some time on the clock for their offense, or someone let a real bonehead touch the controller. And kickers practice for this kind of kick every day. Pretty standard. Nothing standard when you got bloodthirsty mutants on the defensive line. The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty And this rip is definitely on the take. That was a bogus penalty. The offense is running low on quarterbacks. They have only two left. They might consider running the ball more. And they've had enough. The offense jumps on sides and attacks the ref. Yeah. And they'll line up for the punt here. Nice punt. Should move him back nicely. And he snags it. Oh, with the punishing hit. And it's first and ten. Oh, that hit's going to shave a few days off his life. Second down and five. game is starting to soften up the defense first down and it's first and ten and we are all tied up and we're going to overtime go ahead and cancel that quality time with the family and continue to stream at your television this is going to be great
Briggs, overtime is a war with some basic rules. The first touchdown wins the game, but if the team that receives the kickoff gets a field goal, then the other team is allowed a possession too. After that, whomever scores wins. Ah, uh, Grandma, I didn't understand any of that. Can you repeat it? Not a chance. but a tough three yards. Second down and seven. Just some good old downhill running there as he picks up the first down. And it's first and ten. And he was steering a pick six, but dropped the interception. And it's lots of blood and guts spilled in this game. The Orcs of Hazard pulverize the opposition and win by forfeit. There's not much left of the opposition, and the fans are loving it. There was only one way this game was going to end, and that was in a forfeit. That's not quite true, Grim. The alien spacecraft could have crashed into the stadium and ended the game. Uh, how about it? How about if you shut the hell up right now? We go down to the field and listen to what the MVP has to say. Once again, the folks at Evil SN thank our viewing audience and the Mutant Football League for allowing us to telecast this sports presentation. This is Grim Blitzrow with Brickhead Mulligan and Bricks Jr. signing off. Today's final game stats are brought to you by the Micro Heart Corporation. They get it right every up.